can see a circuit diagram. In this circuit diagram which is used in the electric conductor. So the symbols which is used and the components. Now you can see electric cell. Electric cell. The symbol is one long line and a short line. This long line stands for the positive pole of the battery and the short line is negative. Now that is called one single cell that is, called, that is a, considered as a cell. If many cells are there that is called a battery. So the symbol for the battery is many cells joined to form battery. Now plug key. Now in the circuit diagram you can see a plug key which is open. The symbol is like this. And if it is a closed plug key the symbol is this. And wire which is joined and wire without joining. The symbol like this is electric bulb. This is called a resistor. Then rheostat, ammeter and voltmeter. So these are the symbols which is used in the different components. Now let us see real apparatus how it is. The first cell, electric cell. Electric cell you are familiar with that and battery also you know. So now we will see what is this plug key which is open and closed. Now the real apparatus of a plug key is, looks like this. Now this is actually one you can see a plug over here. This is a closed key. Now if you remove this it is called an open key. But the circuit diagrams looks like this. This is open key and this is closed key. Now if you put a plug over here this becomes a closed key. Now you can see this apparatus two screws are here. In this two screws you can tie with a uh, the wire, electric wire can be connected over here and you can tie it with this. And can connect with the electric conductor. Now the next component that is wire, conducting wire. This is the conducting wire that we use in the electric circuit. You can see that here the conducting wire that is here this part of the wire is copper wire is there inside and this part is called the insulation which is covered with that. So this wire can be connected with this different that is the plug which is used over here. Here you can connect with the, the screw with that wire. Then you can connect with another apparatus along with that. So this is the conducting wire. Now comes the electric bulb. Electric bulb you are familiar with that. And resistor. Resistor is normally a wire which resists the flow of current. That is called the resistor. So resistance wire is there. Then another apparatus that is ammeter. Ammeter you can see in the symbol it is simply A is written. And this is called the ammeter. Now the real apparatus of the ammeter it looks like this. You can see here that is the red one plug is there and black one is there. The red is connected always with the positive pole of the battery and black will be connected with the negative pole of the battery with the help of this conducting wire. This wire will be connected with each that is screw and tied with that and connect other end of the wire will be connected with the, the next apparatus like that. Now the next apparatus that is voltmeter. Now voltmeter, this is the voltmeter and voltmeter looks like this. Here also you can see inside V is written. A meter inside A will be written. Now voltmeter as I have uh, earlier to talk earlier. As voltmeter is used to that is to measure the potential difference. And a meter which is used to measure the current. Here also this red is positive and black is negative. The conducting wire will be connected with this. And the other part of the wire will be connected with the other apparatus.